Hello and welcome back to my channel. So today, first of all, thank you for supporting the channel and thank you for like commenting and I'm really happy that I helped you guys with the answer and and with the videos that I make. I'm really glad about that. So today another guide video about leveling. So leveling was before uh, we were used to go to Leomon in Lost Historical Site and do quests there. Not do quests, just do the raid and then our Digimon is gonna level. So right now we're gonna level in the old school or you can go to any raids but you have to be careful. If there's too many people there, you're gonna be safe. If there are no people in there, you're gonna be in problem. So as you can see here, Digimon level are 43. So we're gonna give it a try with level 1 Digimon. So first of all, to reach Server Lake, you need to talk to Elkomon in D Terminal. He's over here. Like next to the dungeons, he's over here. You can talk to him, you're gonna pay him like 20 bytes, 20 mega or something like that, or 25. But you need a Digimon level 41, so you can go there with your starter Digimon. Alright, and then you can come here, and you can see his stats are way too normal. So the thing you're gonna do is just come here, attack, use the skills, just use the skills. There we go, and look at this. Just use a skill, just press one skill and your Digimon is gonna level up. You see like 10 levels in just one hit. So we're gonna need another two levels. And there we go. So just to tell you guys before I keep on going, so you guys say maybe I'm doing something wrong, I'm gonna show you here the accessories are not gonna work until Digimon level 41. Every accessories. They're not gonna work until Digimon level 41. So that's mean I'm just leveling like normally guys. Like like everyone can do that. Just use the skills. You see like it's so fast to do. There we go. And then again. Another skill. You can see like it's so fast leveling right here. As we're almost gonna get level 41. Level 41, almost gonna get it. Alright. So there's another way, and it's way too faster actually. I'm gonna show it to you as well. So, this this was the first way. It's just like to come start with Tsunomon and Tsukumon until you can level your Digimon so, and keep on using skills. So the second way is like it's like laziest way but it's more faster as well. So the second way is just to get the Digimon level 45 as you can see like or 42 and then you can start like do a random request okay. So for example the best thing to do is go to find islands. So this is the second way, not the first way, this is the second way, and go to waterfront. Here we are in waterfront. So in waterfront, the laziest way and the fastest way to do, just like come to Starmon, and the second is here. Hmm, they changed the map since last time I came here. There's too many Digimons right now. Alright. And pick up quests like killing quests. Like you see, like uh, he has like collectible quests as as well. You can you can do that, or you can just pick up, for example, this this quest. It's, it has a pretty good XP. You can do that, and then uh, we don't have here storage. Okay. So you can just pick up requests, like any quest you want, with higher level Digimon, like level 75 or more, and then come to here and pick up the quest, and do the quests, and then come here with a low level Digimon, and change, like that, for example, and then pick up like the quest and press complete, so you can 
pick up the XP and your Digimon gonna level up faster. So usually we did that and we usually like when you level up a Digimon you can go to Leomon in those historical sites but I went there and there was no one in there so we're gonna skip that and we're gonna use those two ways to level from 1 until 45. So level 45 to 75. We're gonna go to the maze entrance. You can do that after like starting questing or when you reach like 10 or 75 I think or something between 60 and 75. You're gonna receive a, qu uh, a quest on your Digivice. When you open the quest, it's gonna tell you to go to Digimon Maze Entrance. When you came here, as you can see here, Digimon, you can level here Digimon in any place in here in this map, it doesn't matter where. Just kill Digimon, find a party, kill a Digimon, and you can level up your Digimon here until 75. So from, 40, from 45 until 75, you can level up your Digimon in here. Alright, from 75, we're gonna go back to Fine Island. Alright, so here we are, Fine Island Waterfront. So I'm gonna just use the center so I want to move faster between places. Alright, so in here we're gonna come to the hill. It's the best spot actually. Actually, the, all are the same, but like everyone come to the hill because like it's better. Because here you can get good XP as well. So we're gonna show you. Like you have here Cyber Drummond. We have, for example, Skull. And you have here Agumon. Argumon. And Pile. And those here. As you can see, here is the best place to level up your Digimon. From 75. From 75 till 95. This is the best place where you can live in Digimon. Okay, 95 and up. After you completed all the quests in the Fire Island map, and after you defeating the Vimon Dungeon in Infinity Mountain, and completed all the quests, you, you're gonna be able to go to Server Continent. So when you go to Server Continent, you don't have to do the quest, you can just move between the maps and go to the pyramid it's we're back again so it's the best place where you can level up your digimon in here and anywhere like pick up any digimon and just do the quests uh, don't do the quest you can just level up your digimon it's fine so here it's gonna be like uh, the best place to level up your digimon till 99 so your digimon is level 99 right now where you have to go you can go to any of Shinjuku map here we are random Shinjuku map I just pick up the first one I, I saw so here you can level up your Digimon as well Digimon here are kinda not that strong and you can level up your Digimon pretty fast but the dungeon are strong you can level up here your Digimon or if you want to like until level 100 five four hundred seven something like that or you can just stay in any of these maps any of these maps you can stay in any of these and you can level up your digimon but you have another option you can go to Ferdendi but Ferdendi is so so hard a little bit hard uh, you can go to uh, Valley of Flights wait a second Valley of Light, it's pretty good to level up your Digimon, but the Digimon there do skills as well. So you can questing in here, or you can questing in here. So you have to pick up which one do you want to quest, and which one do you want to get XP from. And in the end, like almost in the end, you can come to the big site. 120, you can level up your Digimon in here, as you can see in the big site. From 112 or 110 or what's your level, level for your Digimon you can level up here until 120 and that's how you can level up your Digimon fast and quick. Alright so this was our video for today I don't want to make it like much more longer this is, our, this is the video for today 
and I hope you guys you enjoy that. I hope you guys right now know where to level up faster and how to do. And to level up faster, before I go, I just have uh, remembered like before you to level up faster, you're gonna need like XP poster, you're gonna need suit, yellow suit, especially because it's gonna give you good XP. You're gonna need dungeon XP stuff. Or you can buy those actually, you don't have to do dungeon to get those. You can buy those for cheap, or if you don't have enough money, you can use just normal posters, normal XP poster and the yellow suit with the party, like uh, with the party you are playing with, and you're gonna get pretty good XP as well. So, this was our video for today, and I hope you guys enjoyed that. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe. If you have any other question, I'm really be happy to answer your question. So, and see you next time.